This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. Hello and welcome back to Channel T Lover. So if you are new to this channel, please subscribe to this channel and also do not forget to click on our bell icon for our latest update. If you are totally new viewers on this channel, then our channel provides you the free domain, free hosting, free BCC card, and many methods how you can own the digital currency. If you got any problem related to any topic of my video, or if you need any support regarding action approval or monetization, then you can directly contact on T Lover 2054 in the Instagram, or you can join the Telegram channel from the link in the description below. Without wasting time, let's move for the today's content. So in the content of today, I'll teach you how you can apply for the student GitHub pack and how you can use the services of student GitHub pack. Okay. Previously, I had made a video how you can generate a free edu mail. So this is the video by which you can apply for the edu mail. And this is the second video by which you can get activation of the edu mail. And in the third part, I'll just apply here for the GitHub student pack. And I'll just show you how you can take the GitHub student pack benefit. Okay. So in this video, I'll just teach you a step by step process so, so that you can get the benefit from the student GitHub pack. Okay, so let's go for the today's topic without wasting our time. But before that, I have already made a number of videos regarding this topic on my channel. Please go through them. And if you got any problem, any confusion or you have any question regarding this or any topic of my video, then you can contact on tlover2054 in the Instagram so that I can help for you. And this is my website tlaboraofficial.com by which you can get a lot of blog related to tech and technology. Okay, so please subscribe to the channel and the website too to get our latest update. And without wasting time, let's go for it. Okay, so this is our edu mail that we have got uh, at the last time. And I'll just show you that this is the edu mail. Please go for this. And here is the edu mail login access over here. Now we'll just go for the new tab and I'll just show you about the edu mail function. Okay, so this is the edu mail. You can check over this and here we'll just go for the student github pack okay please go for the student github pack so here we'll just go for the student github pack over here and we'll just click on the student github education pack so inside this you can just see the interface of this student github pack uh, previously it was different but they have just make or amend the website over here so here you have to just scroll down and make sure that you have just selected for the student because that we are going to apply for the student over here okay so please just scroll down and go for the join github education please click on this link so in this login page you have to just go scroll down and go for the create an account so please click on this create an account after you that you have to just find this after that you will find this type of option welcome to the github so please provide your email address please go for it then please go for the continue and now you have to just create a password we'll just use the strong password over here make sure that your password is too much strong so that you will not have any problem in the future okay so after that please go for the continue now you have to just provide your username so here you will just use the username as of here we'll just use the username as edu mail chris so we'll just go for the continue now again scroll down and you can just check over it or you can just go for the continue okay so if you just go for the continue then you have to just verify the student github pack by solving this recaptcha here after you just solve for the recaptcha a code has been sent to your mail so please check your mail so this is our mail and here you can just see for the github mail okay so just copy this github mail and again we'll just go for the same website and verify over here okay so this is verifying and we have successfully created an account on this website i'll just provide the email address and we'll just go for the password that we have set for this website okay and we have successfully been to the github student pack okay so here we'll just click on the just me then we'll just go for the continue but before that we'll just take for the student too okay now you scroll down and you have to just skip any of this feature and you have to just go for the continue okay as you can see that there is two pack over this on the github so one is github pro and one is free of github pack okay so we'll just use this free pack of github scroll down and go for the continue for free so now in this option we'll just click on this join github education so please click on this join it github education but before going for that you have to just go for the github profile and you have to just provide some information okay so please go for the profile and here you have to just update some information okay so here if you just scroll down then you have to just go for the edit profile so please provide the full name so after you just provide the full name of the respective person please go for adding bio so this is my first github okay you can use anything on the bio no problem and please go for this save okay so once you just save this this will think that your github is authentic one okay so now we'll just go for the get stream benefit and they have already recognized our tyler junior college video email okay so we'll just click on this select this school and our school is already selected okay so we'll just click on the continue 
but before going for it it has just tell that your github student should contain two factor authentication okay so we'll just use the github account and use this double security over here okay so we'll just click on the two factor authentication and we'll just use the authenticator app over here okay so finally we have add the two factor authentication by using the authenticator app and here we have successfully done this then we'll just go for the done and you are able to go for the get up student pack again okay so please reload this page once again now you can just go for this upload proof of academic status okay so in this next page you have to just upload your proof of academic status to get the github student pack okay so here you have to just provide the id card or any other document to show you as a student okay so we need to take a id card for this so for that we'll just go for the new tab and here we'll just go for the tlover official that is my website okay so please go for the tlover official then in this website please go for the respective website of mine and inside that you will find a section of latest tech news please go for this latest tech news and if you just scroll down then you will find an option of the edu mail card for the github pack okay so we'll just click on this then if you just scroll down you will find our student github pack over here okay so this is the edu mail or this is the id card link okay and you will be redirected to the canva account where you can edit this okay so please go for the edit design you have to continue with your facebook or you have to create an account or you have to just go for the canva account to use this okay so finally you can see that we have successfully get access to our designing and you can just see that i have just updated the all the information of this person okay so this is the id card which i have designed for the uploading in the github student pack okay so we'll just download this please go for this here go for the download and you have to just click for the so here there are 57 pages you have to just click like this and you have to can just click the every section over here okay so as i only need the first page we'll just click for the first and go for the done and please, please click on the download okay once you just click on the download then your download will be started and you can successfully download your id card okay so here is the id card that you can see in the screen okay now we'll use this id card so for using this id card you can find the option of upload over here okay if you just go for the student git path then you can just only see the option for take a picture so we'll just go for the source and we'll just install the application that is obs studio okay so please click on this obs studio so this is the obs studio so here you can just uh, add the scene over here okay so here we'll just go for the add and go for the add source okay so here we'll just go for the add the image so here is the image please go for the image go for the okay now you can browse the image we'll just go for the download and select for the id card that we have downloaded please go for the open go for the okay and your id card will be kept like this okay as you can see that this is your id card okay now let's go for the start virtual camera so please click on the start virtual camera and if you just minimize this and go for the take a picture then you can find the allow this time okay so you can able to use your camera okay so we'll just click the allow this time so here you can see that this is my camera of next so you will just go for the selecting the next camera then we'll just select for the obs virtual camera okay so we'll just click on the obs virtual camera and our id card has been shown over here okay now we'll just take a photo and if you do not have the uh, pc then you can use your mobile phone to capture this so you can just color print this photo and you can upload this using the mobile camera of your okay so please click on the take a photo and after that your photo will be uploaded shortly okay you can see in the screen over here as your id card has been successfully uploaded please scroll down and you can just leave this option and please scroll down and go for the proceed my process my application okay so you just click on the process my application once you just do this then you will be redirected to the next page where you can successfully apply for the student github pack okay so our application is being processing just for it for a while and while this process will go for the hundred percent you will able to get the student beta github pack and it will just take one month or uh, less than one month to get your full access to the student github pack okay so in this way you can apply for the student github pack and your account will be or your student github pack will be ready okay so we have successfully submit our student github pack and it will just take less than nine days to look for it and we'll able to get this student github pack so in this way you can apply for the student github pack and if you got any error any confusion you can contact on tlover2054 in the instagram so that i can help for you and this much for today i'll be again back with you bringing more content like this till then have a good day till our official channel like share and subscribe will value for your support this is how you can get the student github pack 
you love our official channel like share and subscribe we'll value for your support thanks for watching this video thank you